Hi there, Libra, and welcome back to Star Lord is Tarot. This is your tarot forecast for the week of October the 21st through to the 27th. I went ahead, shuffled the cards, laid them all out. Let's see what's going on for Libra. By the way, happy birthday for any of you and Libras that are celebrating birthday this week. First up, we have the Six of Pentacles in the upright, followed then by the Ten of Wands reversed. Next, we have the Ace of Cups in the upright, followed then by Major Arcana of the Sun in the upright. And lastly, we have the Ace of Swords in the upright. Okay, you have two aces here. Interesting. All right, Libra, for your overall energy, you have that of the Six of Pentacles. I do like the Six of Pentacles. This is really nice energy. It's balanced energy. It's a six. Also, two, this is a card that's known of about uh, generosity and... Um, uh, it's about uh, fairness and generosity in terms of uh, material things because it is pentacles. So it could be for some of you, perhaps if you're looking to obtain a loan or a mortgage this week, it could be that the banks are feeling generous. For others of you, this could represent generosity coming from someone else, a friend, a family a member, a, a parent uh, showing generosity and the energies can go both ways. So maybe there's someone in your environment that needs your generosity at this time. For others of you, it could represent uh, fairness, equality coming back into a relationship that lost its um, its balance. So good energy, no matter how you slice it. So that's nice for your overall energy. Libra, coming right off the hop, we do have the Ten of Wands here in the reverse position. This is really good energy because the ten of wands in the upright this is when we're carrying too much of a burden where it's like something's got to give it's just too much it can represent too many worries it can represent too many duties where people are piling uh their duties on us and we're just sort of saying okay for sure it could be family members friends co-workers neighbors what have you but when the card is inverted like this we're uh, finally releasing or um, maybe some of you could be just saying no to people I've already got enough on my plate good for you if that's the way it's going down for you Libra but for others of you it could be that some of these duties have been relieved perhaps you were overworked at a certain point and now that has come to an end and now you can release those duties others of you learn to delegate and um, get help with the things that you were dealing with others of you are just relieving your worries perhaps because now you have um, extra help coming either from a friend a family member a bank or something like that um, it could be an advance from work for some of you, but whatever the case is, you're dropping your worries, you're dropping your burdens, and that's very nice to see right off the hop, and it's paired up with the Ace of Cups in the upright position. Beautiful energy. The Ace of Cups is where our cup is running over with um, newness. It's because the Aces always usher in brand new beginnings in an area of our life. And this is dealing with our emotions or creative projects. So for some of you, it could be a brand new beginning in a creative project. Those of you dealing with the arts, with music or um uh, acting or painting, that kind of thing. If you're artistic, it could be there's a lovely offer around the corner for you. Uh, the universe has manifested it and is bringing it into your existence. For others, if you could represent a new baby or a child being born into the environment, into the household, and it's just that beautiful when you look at that brand new born baby where you just your heart swells and you just feel really good. For others of you, it could be representing opening your heart again after a time of when your heart was closed. Um, it's going to be different for all of you because it's just a general read. But very good energy for some of you. You're finally um, accepting that self-love, which is really, really nice. And then moving on towards the weekend, we do have the beautiful energies here of the sun in the upright position, the Leo card. Some of you could be connecting with a Leo. Others of you, <clears throat> this could just represent... The, the sun represents a victory, success, attainment, all of the things that we're working towards, it's all sort of manifesting. And we're feeling very victorious in uh, the sun's energy. It can also uh, come up for those of you who have been sort of feeling a little bit under the weather, feeling a little bit uh, 
you know, not well, so your vitality could be returning. Your your vitality could be returning because you've opened your heart again and you're feeling really good on the emotional front. So you feel vital like your vitality is much better. Uh, others of you could be due to like a maybe overwork situation and you were overburdened. And now you've released that, so you have more freed up energy. And the last card you have up is another ace here. We have the ace of swords in the upright position. Again, new beginnings. This could be a new beginning for some of you in communication. It could be how you communicate with uh, another person. It could be that you're communicating in a new way. For others of you, the uh, ace of swords can represent a new idea popping into your head of something you want to uh, maybe expand on because the swords represent our, our mind, our mental cerebral, also our um, vocabulary and how we speak. So it could be for some of you there is a new um, a new form of communication coming through to you or it could be a brand new spark, a brand new idea that sort of takes you in a new direction. So beautiful reading here, really nice to see for you, Libra, for a change. Your readings have been a little bit, you know, give and take, but um, this one seems to be like, you know, you're on a much better road, a lot of renewal happening. I love seeing the sun here for you. And in closing, I will be pulling a Chakra Wisdom Oracle card for you just to see what extra messages the uh, Spirit has for you. And we do see acceptance here, acceptance. Very nice card. So it means whatever it means for you. It could be about accepting all these new beginnings. And uh, that's it. <laughs> so I hope this reading helped you. If it did, please feel free to like, share, and subscribe. Otherwise, I will see you next week. Bye-bye for now.